All right, it is on to the finale for Fox's MasterChef Junior down to the wire. Just one episode left, part two of a two-part season finale. And Bryson McGlynn, the favorite here at the station because of his ties to Wisconsin and his nickname of Cheese Curd, joining us with the cheese head hat. We got you covered too out here, Bryson, ahead of Monday night's finale episode. But for folks who are not uh, catching up on the show, you still have one more shot to do it. But you advance with two other kids to the two-part finale what was different about that experience than any of the other challenges on this season so far? Uh, one big one was we were all together in one spot that actually uh, made me feel very comfortable. So that was one big change. And what are you guys making in the finale? Because we got you halfway through the challenge. So where are you at right now? What do you still have to do on Monday night? Uh, we still have to do our entree and then our dessert. Looks pretty good, though, from what we've seen from you so far. One of the other best parts I saw in one of the clips, I believe your whole family gets to be there actually in studio watching you compete for this title, especially for your dad, which is the reason that you have the nickname Cheese Curd. He's from Wisconsin and had that nickname himself. What was it like for you to be performing in front of him? It was amazing for me because I felt like he was always there helping me even though he couldn't help me. It was always nice just seeing him and he gave me some extra talks to help me out. That is so cool. Uh, I'm really struck by this as well, and we're seeing it here in some of the uh, clips that we're showing. Just the collaboration and the camaraderie between you and the other contestants on this show. Yes, you guys all want to win, but it seems like a really great group. How close did you get with the other contestants and other kids? We got really close. I called it a family because I always thought barbecue and grilling competitions made family. So for me, and I felt like all the kids, it was family. Absolutely. We want to try some of that barbecue, too, uh, cheese curd bracing <laughs> out there as well. Okay, so looking ahead to Monday, and then looking past that, what do you hope to do with this? You've gotten a lot of experience, some that most kids don't get at this age. Where do you hope to go with this? I wanted to do some cooking classes to improve my skills and later on go to culinary school. Was there one part of the season so far that you'll always remember that really stands out from, I'm sure, what was just an amazing experience overall? Uh, yes. One big one was, of course, the finale because you're in the ring of fire, which sounds really, really scary. <laughs> it's pretty intense. Uh, Bryson, I have to ask, are you at school right now? <laughs> was that the bell going off for class? Yes, sir. <laughs> okay. Well, we want to get you back to class. We won't, don't want to upset any of the teachers down there in Alabama. But thank you so much for being a part of this with us throughout the season. You had a lot of folks here in Wisconsin, your dad's home state, cheering you on, even if you are uh, living in Alabama now. So go cheese curd. You can watch the finale part two Monday night right here on Fox. What class are you going back to? What do we have to get you in for? Uh, English. <laughs> English. And I want to say... Thank you so much, Fox 6, for all the support that y'all have had with me. It's been so much fun watching you, so uh, sending you a whole lot of good luck for Monday's finale episode. And who knows, maybe you need to take over lunch from the cafeteria workers there at your school. <laughs> <laughs> Serve up maybe. some real gourmet meals for the, your uh, fellow students there. Thank you so much, and good luck on Monday.